In the vast and mysterious reaches of our solar system, there are places where the impossible becomes reality. While diamonds are considered rare and precious on Earth, they may be falling from the skies in storms of shimmering crystals on two of the largest planets in our cosmic neighborhood, Jupiter and Saturn. This mind-boggling phenomenon has fascinated scientists for years, and recent research suggests that diamond rain could be a common feature of these gas giants' extreme environments. But how is such a thing possible? What conditions make this otherworldly spectacle happen? And what would it actually look like if we could witness it firsthand, to understand the formation of diamonds on Jupiter and Saturn? We must first explore the unique chemical and atmospheric conditions on these planets. Unlike Earth, where diamonds are formed deep within the mantle under intense heat and pressure, the process on gas giants follows a completely different path. Both Jupiter and Saturn have atmospheres rich in methane, a simple carbon-based molecule. When the violent storms on these planets generate powerful lightning, the energy from these strikes breaks the methane molecules apart, releasing carbon atoms into the atmosphere. These freed carbon atoms begin a dramatic journey through the planet's layers. As they descend deeper into the thick, turbulent clouds, they start to bond together, first forming tiny particles of graphite, the same material found in pencil lead. But the descent doesn't stop there. As the graphite particles continue their downward plunge, they are subjected to increasingly intense pressure and heat. At depths where the atmospheric pressure reaches thousands of times that of Earth's surface, the graphite undergoes a spectacular transformation. The carbon atoms rearrange into a crystalline structure, forming diamonds, literal gemstones created by the crushing forces of these massive planets. Unlike the diamonds we mine on Earth, which take millions or even billions of years to form deep underground, these extraterrestrial diamonds may be created relatively quickly due to the extreme pressure changes in Jupiter and Saturn's atmospheres. Once formed, the newly born diamonds continue their descent through the planet's gaseous layers. For a time, they might float freely, like raindrops suspended in a dense, alien sky. But eventually, they sink further into the crushing depths, where temperatures soar to thousands of degrees Celsius. Here, the diamonds face their final fate, they melt into liquid carbon, vanishing back into the planet's turbulent core. This incredible process suggests that diamond rain is not a rare occurrence but a regular part of Jupiter and Saturn's weather cycles. Some scientists estimate that Saturn alone could produce around a thousand tons of diamonds each year. Unlike on Earth, where diamonds must be laboriously extracted from deep within the planet, on Saturn and Jupiter, they might be casually falling from the sky like ordinary raindrops, only to disappear before anyone could ever hope to collect them. If humans could travel to these gas giants and somehow withstand their brutal environments, what would we see? The idea of diamond storms conjures images of glowing crystals tumbling through the clouds, flashing like tiny stars as they reflect the distant light of the sun. In reality, the process might be less dramatic to the human eye but no less astonishing in its implications. The diamonds forming in these atmospheres would likely be microscopic at first, growing as they descend. Some might become large enough to be comparable to the ones found on Earth, and a few might even reach sizes of several centimeters across. Jupiter and Saturn may not be the only celestial bodies with diamond rain. Scientists speculate that other gas giants in our solar system, such as Neptune and Uranus, could experience similar processes, and perhaps even more dramatically due to their slightly different atmospheric compositions. If this phenomenon is common among large planets, then diamond rain might not be rare at all, it could be one of the most widespread yet hidden wonders of the universe. The study of diamond rain is more than just a fascinating curiosity, it has serious scientific implications. 
Understanding how carbon behaves under extreme conditions helps researchers model the interiors of gas giants, improving our knowledge of planetary formation and evolution. It also raises intriguing possibilities about exoplanets, planets orbiting other stars. If gas giants beyond our solar system share the same atmospheric conditions as Jupiter and Saturn, then diamonds might be raining on distant worlds across the galaxy, however, the dream of collecting these cosmic jewels remains far beyond our reach. Jupiter and Saturn are among the most hostile environments imaginable. Their crushing gravity, powerful storms, and extreme temperatures make direct exploration nearly impossible with current technology. Even if we could send a probe deep enough to reach the diamond-forming layers, it would be quickly destroyed by the immense pressure and heat. The diamonds, too, would not last long enough to be gathered, as they eventually melt into liquid carbon before reaching the planet's cores. Despite this, the discovery of diamond rain on Jupiter and Saturn expands our understanding of the incredible diversity of planetary weather systems. Earth has its storms of water and ice, Mars has dust storms that can engulf the entire planet, Venus has sulfuric acid rain, and Jupiter and Saturn have showers of glittering gemstones. Each of these unique weather phenomena tells a story about the planets they occur on, offering glimpses into the forces that shape their atmospheres and compositions, ultimately, the knowledge that diamonds are raining from the skies of our solar system's gas giants serves as a humbling reminder of how strange and wonderful the universe can be. While we value diamonds on Earth for their rarity and brilliance. In the vast reaches of space, they may be nothing more than another fleeting element in an ever-changing cosmic dance. What we consider precious and extraordinary might be, on a grander scale, just another part of a planet's natural cycle, common, ephemeral, and beyond our grasp, perhaps one day, as space exploration advances, we will be able to witness this breathtaking phenomenon firsthand. Until then, the diamond rains of Jupiter and Saturn remain one of the most mesmerizing and mysterious spectacles hidden within the depths of our solar system, a glittering storm in the endless cosmic expanse.